Hello everyone, this is Victor Campos, and we're looking at Pinterest for business. So in our previous videos, we were uh, setting up our profile and interacting and such. Uh, I'm here back on my profile, and I want to explore other aspects of it. So here I'm seeing boards, and these are the three boards that I created and started to add content to. That's organization. If I look under pins, everything that I've pinned shows up here in a long, continuous scroll. And then everything that I've liked shows up here. I can do this for myself and for people. So I want to see what Jamie Lynn has uh, has got in in the same vein. So uh, if I click on her picture, it goes over to her profile. She's Pinterest.com slash iHeartNapTime. And I can see here, these are her 68 boards of organization. And I can say, well, I'm also interested in following mm -hmm. Um, I love nap time recipes, so I'll follow that, and I'll see that content. All the 15,000 pins that she has uh, liked shows up, show up here in a really long scroll, and I can go here and also like it. And then her likes are shown up under likes. Same thing, easy. She has 3.9 million followers, and she's following 1,296 accounts. So you click on that. Here is Here are the interests that she is following, or the particular pinners, their accounts, or their boards. So this is how you can discover more content. If a person with nearly 4 million followers is... Um, following one of these accounts it might be it might behoove you to follow them too so seek out these tastemakers that you care about and follow what they're following you can look at the boards same sort of thing genius dot recipes etc and then her particular followers same sort of thing for discovery you can make a decision of what of what um, accounts to follow by their particular stats. So Lace for Style, Bridget Call, just follow someone. And so I'm going to go back to my own profile. I don't have any followers at the moment, but that'll change. And then I can go to my own following. I've got these interests and the pinners that I'm following and the boards that I'm following. That's why when I go back home here, I get content. So that's a little bit about managing your profile. We have the option to send the profile to share with people. So I can add the message here, check my pins. If they're on Pinterest, I can send them the profile or send it via Twitter and such. And that'll get sent over to them and I can get more more followers. So on our next videos, we're going to look at other aspects of Pinterest, such as our settings, very important to look at. So come back for that.